Last time, we uh, attempted to go into the crater to get this power core, right? And uh, well, the ghouls, the Wendigos, kind of messed us up a little bit. And it kind of hurt. So, hopefully, now that we've gained one level, we won't get hurt as badly. <laughs> oh, no, we're screwed. There's going to be deaths. Multiple, multiple deaths. That's how it's going to be. Although, maybe our brand new harpoon gun will uh, come in handy and make it so we don't get completely murdered. Although we're going to have to go to Bright Town, I think. Or we can go to the Lonely Sewers and go up from there instead of Bright Town, which could be dangerous since it's Swarm of Windigos. We'll, we'll go from Bright Town. Why not? What's the worst that could happen, LOL? Except for this, like, constant rain, artillery fire downpour. Which is, like, terrifying. This is, like, a really heavy rain, too. I love it. But, like, goddamn. Alright. <clears throat> so there's, like, no, that's lightning or what that is. Okay, let's just not get struck. All right, we're back in the crater. This crater has to be full of water by now. Like, good goddamn. So I look down, no rain. Look up, rain. Look down, no rain. Look up, rain. <laughs> That's fucked up. There was another strike, okay. All right. Mm -mm. Let's take a moment here. Can I see anybody? I can, okay. So maybe we take out the covert rifle. Since I don't think anyone can see us right now, or technically kind of stealth. Maybe we uh pop some heads, huh? If possible. Unless of course we get struck by whatever the hell that is. Nothing. God damn, okay. I mean, he's not, like, actively coming to get us, so. Fuck, okay. How about this one? Come on, you little shit. Stop moving. Ah. Uh... Damn it. Danger. From what? None of these fuckers see me, right? Maybe I should use a stealth boy. Yeah, this is not gonna work at all. Okay. I got a critical strike though. Well, let's go down. The Church of Eternal Life. That just sounds really great. Alright, let's try out this uh, harpoon gun, shall we? Oh no, I fell. Oh no, I fell. Oh no, I fell. I'm stuck. Yeah, I'm kind of stuck here. Okay, I'm just gonna toggle collision to get back up here because I was stuck and I was definitely going to die and did not want to uh, walk back. Okay. We'll, we'll go here. Uh, am I like in the ground? No, I'm just crouching. I can't get over this. Eh. Okay, am I actually stuck here? Hold on. Toggle collision. We'll just fly and let ourselves be like dropped real quick. Go. Okay. Wow. What a shitty harpoon. Oh, started to slide. Oh my god, I cannot aim with this. What? Excuse me? Bruh. Maybe uh, that's only for this weapon? Hmm? Right in the head. And that did nothing. You love to see it. Okay. Yeah, it's gonna do two bars of health to him. Shit, man. Well, oh, shotgun time. Oh god, one got up. Nope, you stay down there, sir. Evil little shits.
Good God, what is that effect? Come on. Die, you like, burned victim thing. Come on. There we go. <clears throat> Where did the other ones go? There's like a bunch more of them. There's one up there. Hit him. Ah, missed him. Not enough percentage to hit here. Oh, 72 on the head? Sure. Is that a try? Might be more worth it to uh, just not scope in and kill these guys. I'm not like scoring a bunch of headshots anyway. In fact, I'm missing more than anything. All right, now we aim at the head. Get that crit, come on. Yeah, boy. Yeehaw. Can't see, there we go. And snap, and pop. And, wait, what? I just did one, okay. Another one. There we go. Oops, missed that one. There we go. Okay. I'm still in danger. So where are the other ones at? Up there, up there, over there. It's lovely. I'd like to kill as many as possible because I definitely know if I do not, when I come out of this place, they're gonna like all try to nom on me because there's no way I'm gonna get back up here to get out. I'm gonna have to take the actual route out, which is not gonna be great. In fact, let's just save real quick. Ow! Okay, that one was really close. Wait, are they going around? Oh man, I don't like that. Screw it, let's go. I just saved. Let's go. Ouch. Doesn't help. I can't really see when that happens. Is this a path? Or is this just like... Dead end? Is there a crawling around up there? Okay. This seems like nothing. Yeah, this is just a little over arch area. I guess just follow the bottles. Those will get you where you're going. Huh? Until you get, like, sucker punched by a fucking Wendigo. There they are. Any more on my back here? Doesn't look like it. Alright, let's go, boys! Oh, fuck. They're lunge, too. Goddamn. Fifty percent hit chance to hit the head. That's not great. Oh, hold on! Don't hit me. I'm reloading. Fuck these things, dude. Goddamn. Where the other ones go? Oh, they decided to go back the other way. Okay, that's right. Go back the way you came. Or a carpoon. Oh, it's electrical. Okay. Well then, how about some incendiary? I got one incendiary harpoon. Let's we'll see how that does, huh? I think it missed. Yeah, that doesn't seem to do much against uh, them. Maybe it would do more against like a. Uh, Uh, words. A robot or something. <clears throat> Fuck you, buddy! How we doing? How we doing? Not a good chance to hit. Okay, that one's dead. Just reload those couple of bullets. 
What have they got on them? Oh, they actually have a decent amount of like ammunition and shit. That's okay. Tales of Chivalry. Hmm. Where did I want to go killed? Another one I go killed? Huh? My. Lose my mind. All right, let's get real close as close as we can, and do a couple headshots. Oh, we got him right before he hit me. Very nice. Very nice. Well, it looks like we got our uh, harpoons back if we hit them. At least there's a chance to get them back. Kind of like arrows and stuff, I guess, huh? All right, let's do a quick save here. We'll just clear out this upper area and make sure there's nothing else around here. This is just a... Uh, Hollowed out building, nothing up here. Nope, okay. Doesn't seem to be anything else up around this area, so. All right. I think we're safe to go back into it, and hopefully, we'll uh, not get our asses kicked by a bunch of ghoulies, huh? Or at least if we do, we hopefully have enough. Uh, Stuff to like move around and not get like trapped by them and stuff. You know what I'm saying? Hold on, I'll delete that one. Might as well, right? Fireworks, saw disc. Thank you, sir. Nope. Was that nope? That was just debris flying around. Bottle caps, some harpoons, and some saw discs. I think right down here is a little bit more. Yes, sir. Um, I'll take all that. All right. The Iris Church, or Iris Door to the Church of the Eternal Light. Well, this is going to be interesting. Fuck, it is going to be interesting. God damn it. Hold on. Do that. Don't you come at me. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Walk away. You can't touch this, can you? Oh, no. Oh, you son of a bitch. That's right. You can't come upstairs. You're too wide, aren't you? Watch him just like clip. I'm oh, God, you did it. Ah! I was just joking, man. No hard feelings. Ha ha. Yeah, actually, not too tough. There we go. Put a couple more shells in you. There you are. <clears throat> I was expecting to do a lot more damage to me, but uh, <laughs> I'll take that. A silo utility vault door. Take that. And um, that's about all I'll take there. Okay. All right, he's dead. Let's uh, take some rat away. Where are my rads at? Right there, rads. Uh, one more for the road, okay. For a second I thought it was just gonna be like the core right behind this door here. And then uh, we would just be able to leave, but. Oh my. Oh my. Oh, at least they're just normal ghouls, okay. Oh, that's a nuke. Hello, everyone. Y'all, uh, y'all having some fun? Okay, okay music. You can, you can literally stop right now. Seek there the wildland life. Ego. The waters of life. You know what I'm gonna say? Uh, yeah, that's not gonna, not gonna get near that. Seek there the wildland life. If I just uh, go down here, is the power core in this? Investigate the Titan. It's an old but still active nuclear ICBM. Don't poke it. That's fair. But can I activate it or something? That'd be fun, right? Eternal Life followers. This is a almost feral looking ghoul. Goddamn. He's about to go feral.
I'm gonna go down here and then I have to go all the way back up because there's nothing down here. That's how it's gonna go. That's a lot of radiation right there. Eternal life follower. Eternal life follower. Life follower. Life follower. Yep. No one of importance down here. Man, I do not want to go in that water. Live for eternity. Okay. Well, I should have saw that coming. Also, I really want these like glowing irradiated bottles. Like, that'd be fun to decorate hey, my base with in Fallout 76. Live for eternity. All right, well, let's go talk to the uh, the head priest boy, I suppose. Since these guys are being Live friendly enough. For eternity. You're like a normie, you're a normie. That bottle's, oh, I thought it was floating for a second there. Some empty foot lockers. Liquor cabinet. Oh, hi. Nope. Nothing happens if I activate from up here. Uh, one of the stairs right over here. Bruh, the music though. Ooh. Charge of radioactivity fluid. What an acolyte. Live for eternity. Bruh. That's a nice mask you got there. Live for eternity. Eternal life priest. Acolyte. Some random stuff here. I'm assuming I can't go through this door. Nope. Okay. Give praise to the model. Is that a is that a book right down there, sir? A new visitor. Also, and you're an unholy one. This is very unusual to have an unholy guest arrive in our church. No unholy yeah. has ever survived the holy guardians of the church. Perhaps faith has brought you here, unholy one. It was bullets that did it. Bullets did that. Let's see, you have anything that resembles a tube with a glowing green light in the center? Am I allowed to join the church? We may have something of the likes in our stockpile, but it is strictly off limits to unholy such as yourself. Wait, I what? hope you understand. No, I didn't ask that. I asked if I could join your church. We have never allowed an unholy one to enter into our flock. I am afraid it is not up to me to decide. You will have to speak to our high priest. He is the wisest of us all, and who we all follow. He will decide your fate. Where's he at? But be warned. If the high priest expresses any displeasure in you, we will, by order, have to cover you in pitch and burn you alive. I'll unlock the door to the high priest. Hope it goes well for you. Okay. You've returned. But, unholy one. The unholy are ones who have yet to shed their mortal flesh and embrace the eternal life. Only once you have undergone the transformation to remove your earthliness, you will be seen as holy. Hmm. Holy Garden. They are the ones who have fully shed their earthliness, allowing them to become holy guardians of the church. So Pharaoh is Ghoul's when it goes, that kind of thing. Can be gotcha. achieved in our church, and is what we all aspire to one day become. Hmm. Church is a little bit crazy. What's your church believe? We believe in embracing the eternal life through shedding our earthly flesh and bathing in the waters of life. We seek to achieve otherworldly enlightenments without the tiresome need to constantly satisfy our earthly desires to eat, drink, sleep, or fornicate. We may only need to bathe in the waters of life to achieve immortality. All right, so you're sure Church warships an undetonated nuclear warhead. Nuclear warhead? Ah, you must be referring to the monolith in the center of the church. Yes, we give praise to this monolith for providing us with the waters of life needed to baptize ourselves and achieve eternal life. We believe this monolith was left by the gods to help us seek their enlightenment. Okay. Good talk. I gotta go. I, I am real curious about what that is, though. It's like, uh, is that a, a ghoul hand holding a potato with nails in it? Is that what that is? Also, hold on. Can I? I don't know what key. Mm. 
I wonder if I can pickpocket that weapon off of him. But, uh, I might come back and kill you for that later. Oh. It teleports me. Okay. I'm getting irradiated by the second here. It's lovely. You again? God damn it, this guy. Hello there, high priest. Uh... Is this going to be like in Fallout 3 where this guy was like, ah, rah, 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 and I just like interpret for him and be like, yeah, he said I'm cool. That's going to be exactly what this is, isn't it? Hello. Can you even speak? <laughs> mm, yes, yes, of course. Okay, I'm going to go. Uh, good talk, good talk. Do you got anything in here that I can like take though? Can I like kill you maybe? Got a nuka cola. Oh, you got some. Well, enjoy that. I'm gonna tell him the priest said I was okay. Well, what did the high priest have to say? Uh, he said I could join. Ah, excellent. <laughs> the high priest has given you his blessings. Easy. But this was only the first step to becoming a member of the eternal life. You must next baptize yourself in the waters of life. Mm. Venture down to the glowing pool at the bottom of the monolith and soak in its glory for no less than 30 seconds. Oh. Okay. Bathe in the waters of life. Well, if you say so. Let me down. No, damn it. I was hoping to just like fall through the, the area to like make it down there faster, like that. Perfect. And then like this. And then like this. Yeah, okay. Let's see here. Take a rat X. Take a rat away. Oh, this is this is fun. Let me uh I'm gonna get over to the side of here. Here we go. Yep, still in it, technically. Still technically in it. Don't mind me. Just just bathing. Is it going to tell me when I'm done? I hope it does. Once it maxes out, I think I'm uh, dead. But I should be able to take some rat away to get it go down again. All right, we're done. I'm not going to take a rat away quite yet because it might be like, go back down and get more radiated, you mouth breather or, eternity. or something. Who knows? The music is just bopping compared to what uh, I feel like is going on right now. Man, I really want that guy's weapon. I mean, I'm sure it sucks, but I really want it. Just to like add it to my collection. Hello, priest. I can already see the earthliness beginning to shed from you. The essence of eternal life has cleansed you. Your trials are nearly complete. All that is left is to find Ghoul Jesus. Accept Ghoul Jesus into your heart and yeah. be given his blessings. Look for Ghoul Jesus at the ruined church on the hill just south of here. He will give you his blessings when he appears to you, but you must first accept him into your heart before he will come before you. You can begin your pilgrimage as soon as you feel you are ready. Uh, okay. There we go. We'll just go ahead and get rid of my radiation. Have you found Ghoul? I'm gonna go. What if I just lie? Have you found Ghoul G Very well. Yes, you will need to show me the receipt. You give the receipt? That's silly. Okay. So I need to go talk to Ghoul Jesus, who is on a church south of here, huh? He's at the abandoned church. Uh, 
Is that where the priest was like down below where I like killed the priest before? Oh wait, I wasn't streaming that, never mind. <clears throat> I thought another ghoul just appeared because the dust was falling. Kind of uh, startled me. All right. Oh, there was a ghoul right there, wasn't there? Is that why I've been like constantly under the music? Fuck you, buddy! But fuck you! Okay. Well. Uh, take it all. Nice. Dude, that perk to get, like, free shit or, like, free ammunition from, like, kills is, is really, really uh, helping out here. Alright, so let's travel this abandoned church. Maybe that's what the top part of it is for. Who knows? We'll see. Yep. Uh, Ghoul Jesus, are you here? Oh, hey. Hey, what the fuck do you think you're doing here, Smoothkin? Don't make one move or I'll blow your fucking head off. I'm looking for Ghoul Jesus? Oh. Hmm. Wait just a sec. Hold on. No, what are you doing? It is I, <laughs> Ghoul Jesus. I can see you have come here for my blessings, my child. That will be, hmm, 200 bottle caps. Look, you're obviously not fooling me. <sighs> I guess we're not as stupid as all those ghouls living in the crater. So why are you here looking for Ghoul Jesus, smooth skin? Why are you dressing up as Ghoul Jesus? Because those idiot ghoul cultists actually believe I'm ghoul Jesus or something. They keep sending me their new recruits. So I put on this disguise and tells them they have to pay up for my blessings. It's an easy racket, and they're none the wiser. That's fair. So, uh, any of the ghouls of the crater to accept me? I don't know what you're planning, but you better not be ruining this racket for me. Here, I'll give you the receipt you need to show those ghouls to make them think their ghoul Jesus gave you his blessings. Now get out of here before you blow my cover. Good talk. <laughs> oh my god. Of course. As one does. Alright. Next, back to the church. So where's it gonna spawn me at? All the way up top, or am I gonna be like near the door? It looks like all the way up top. Okay. That's fair. The fuck? Why are you out here? Bathe in the waters of life. Yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello, I've got a receipt. Have you found cool Jesus? Yeah, here's the receipt. Excellent. I hereby welcome you as a follower of the Church of Eternal Life. You may bathe and drink from the waters of life as you please. I will also now grant you access to our stockpile. Feel free to take what you like and help spread the essence of eternal life throughout the world. Yeah, just like that. By successfully completing the ritual, you become a follower of the eternal life. You have gained a 5% increase in radiation resistance. Okay. And they accept me. Okay. Well, can I talk to him again? Hold on. No? Okay. I do want to just, like, knob him right in the head and, uh, see what his weapon is. Wait, they don't care? Oh, no, they do. What did he have? A uh, handyman. A uh, ghoulish flame damage. 13 damage. Some DPS. Normal stuff. And then he had apparently one... 25 137M793 shell on him? Okay. Well, don't mind me, guys. Just gonna reload. Yeah. Just wanted to see what the hand was. Interesting. If it did more damage, it might be cooler, but it's just a, a random melee weapon. Oh, that's lovely. 
going to go ahead and just take that. Irradiated crunchy muted fruit. I'll take some mini nukes, why not? Someone just say something? Just a bunch of radiated shit. Anything else back here? What's that? Handyman? Oh, cool. I get one. I don't even have to knock that guy out for it. Handyman! All right. <clears throat> You gain the free radical perk. What's that? Free radical. Gain enhanced effects from Radaway. Oh, swag. Man, New Vegas was like just so great in terms of like perks and stuff, because you would actually get like perks from doing stuff a lot. Not just like actually, does Fallout 4 not even have perks other than like the normal special stuff? Like they don't have like special like special perks, right? Man, all the more reason why New Vegas is like a, a just an amazing Fallout game. All right, <clears throat> we've got our uh, power cores. So let's head on back to uh, Camp Phoenix. Bum -ba -da -dum -bum -bum. Okay. Do, 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 do. And I'm going to go ahead and store my uh, handyman. Actually, I want to see what it looks like when I have it equipped. Hold on. Handyman! Yep. Just a uh, ghoul arm. That's, that's lovely. Okay. I'm just going to store it in my house. All right. Along with the plasma caster and all that good stuff. And the bull shotgun, which I don't know actually why I'm keeping that. Maybe I was keeping it to sell it? I don't know. It goes there now, though. Yeah, maybe I store the harpoon gun, too, because it kind of sucks. Being honest. Okay. Oh, they give me eternal life robes. That's cool. I don't need them, though, so I'm going to store those. Uh, let's see. Let's store the max silencer. Actually, I don't even need to store that shit since I, like, it doesn't weigh anything. It doesn't hurt anything. Okay. Let's go talk to b b b b b b Black Water? Black Man? I forget his name. It was Black something, right? Where that boy at? Oh, he's probably down in the. I was touched by your funeral speech. Same. They're still talking about the funeral speech, guys. Get over it. They're dead. You gotta let it go. What are we going to do without Wolfpack? What are we gonna do without Wolfpack? I don't know. Probably like. Rely on me a lot more. Oh, my giddy aunt. I'm just going to toggle collision and go down here <laughs> instead of walking all the way down. Is this the way I'm going? I don't remember which way is which here. What's further down, though? Inaccessible. Okay, that's fair. Stop. Alexa started to speak. Stop again. Sorry, I don't know that. That's fine. Okay, I think I can toggle off collision. Oh, thank God. I was, like, not looking forward to, uh, doing that. Hello there. Man, I wish there was a faster way to get down here. Or that he was just in his office and I can give him this shit. Sarah. Surprised to see you down here in the gutter. Though, I can't say I mind the company. Not the voice First I was name Sarah, last name's Rosin. You want to talk, or are you just sightseeing? Got any work? I've got everything covered here, but if you're willing to hike around the front, 
I've okay. been having trouble getting messages to our outpost in the region. Okay. I think something may be... So go check the, the outpost. Okay. Outpost Henderson. Uh, NCR radio. What am I going to get for this? Is it an Ferris normal out here? Uh, I'll see what I can do. Cool. I got a new quest that I can do later. Ooh. A lever. Again, I'm going to toggle collision and just go through this. So do you think he's above or below deck here? Probably above, right? Or he's in it in the bridge or something. What's that? It's a little eyebot. What, 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 where am I going? I'm not talking to you. Where the hell is this man's at? Is he down there? Yep. Clap. Man. It took me so long to get out here, you guys. I guess this is the crew. We got Badger, Tiger, Caboose, Freak Show. Ah, he's called Freak Show because he's a ghoul. We got Rogue, Officer Parks, we got Watchmen, we got Mustang, we got Roach, Turner, and Siren, the Doctor. We also got a scientist. All right, Blackthorn, that was his name, right, right, right. Courier, I'm hoping you were successful in your search for the power cores. I found these. Excellent, and just in time. I've just finished assembling the team that will be assisting you on your mission to Archimedes II. Each of these operatives has been handpicked for their special skills and experience. I can give you a quick briefing on each of them so you'll know how to best utilize their abilities. They're also ready to begin the mission whenever you are, Courier. Just be sure you're absolutely prepared. We don't know what will be encountered up there, and it may be some time before you can return. Hmm. If you have any preparations that need to be done, do them now. Am I actually going to make like decisions for them? Like choose who's best to do stuff. Give me a briefing. Very well. Officer Parks, your distinguished leader, knows how to hold a team together and always puts his comrades before himself. He'll be helping you to lead the mission. Badger, marksman, skilled soldier but cocky. He's always willing to do what's necessary and should prove to be a reliable soldier. Mustang, seasoned warrior, fought in the NCR BOS war for much longer than anyone in the frontier. He should be able to provide the support needed when in a tight situation. Rogue, computer expert and hacker. She may be able to decrypt the Enclave's technology and give you an advantage over them by turning their weapons against them. Okay. Tuner, comms expert. Not too experienced in combat, but may be necessary to establish a communications network on the station to allow in reinforcements. Siren, field medic. She'll be able to attend to the injuries of any soldiers while on the mission. She was able to help patch you up, Courier, so I know she will be a reliable asset. Freak Show, Ghoul. His ghoulification should make him very resistant to radiation. The space station is likely nuclear powered, so you may find yourself in a situation that only a ghoul can survive in. Watchmen and Caboose are both engineers and will be necessary to analyzing the Enclave's hardware. The okay. Enclave will have superior weapons to us, and we'll need to quickly learn how to take advantage of their technology. And finally, we have our pilots, Tiger and Roach. The Verta shuttles are similar enough to the Verta birds that piloting them won't be too much of a challenge. You'll be relying on them to get you to the space station safely and back. A well-rounded and strategic team. You should uh, have no problem relying on them to get the job done. What, what, what about Caboose, though? Did he not mention Caboose, or did I miss it? I'll address the team. Men, women... Today, you will be embarking on the most extraordinary mission the NCR has ever undertaken. You will be traveling to an orbital space station controlled by the remnants of the Enclave, who seek to destroy and enslave us. I understand if you may be terrified, thrilled, or even fascinated by this mission. We don't know what you may encounter while on this mission. Some of the most advanced technology we have ever witnessed will be found on this space station. 
technology that could prove invaluable to us. The NCR have defeated the Enclave in the past, and we will defeat them again. Each of you have been hand-selected for this mission for your unique set of skills and abilities. As long as you all work together as a unit, I'm sure this mission will be a success. The Courier will be spearheading the operation. The objective is simple. Secure the Archimedes II space station and ensure it is out of the control of the Enclave. Anyone have any questions? Are we actually going into outer space? Yes. You will all be the first in the NCR to go to space. Awesome! Won't we suffocate up in space? Caboose is dead. You'll each be equipped with spacesuits that were recovered from the Enclave camp that will provide you with life support while in space. How are we to pilot these Verta shuttles in space? None of us have ever had any experience with them. You'll only need to pilot the Verta shuttles into space. Once in orbit, the autopilot will take you to the space station. Wouldn't the Enclave see us coming and just destroy us? How are we to board the space station? We've been receiving distress signals from the space station requesting Verta shuttles to help evacuate it. I don't have much information of what this distress is about, but what? I think this will allow our Verta shuttles to dock on the station without too much suspicion. Hopefully, the Enclave will think you're one of theirs responding to the distress call. Once we get on board, how will we proceed? It will be up to you on how to proceed. We have no information on the interior of this space station. You'll have to figure out your situation and improvise once on board. Any more questions? Then I guess we're settled. Suit I, up and prepare for takeoff. I have a question. If they're already sending a distress signal, why are we going? Well, here we go. So are we taking two separate shuttles? I guess that's why we took two power cores, ain't it? Figured we'd all be in one, but uh, apparently not. Also, I'm guessing they're being attacked by aliens, like the actual aliens, because what what modders would not take the opportunity to actually uh, include uh, aliens? Everyone strapped in? Yeah, let's do this. All right, prepare for launch. And they were never seen from again. Chapter three. Let's go to space, boy. So is that the laser or is that the uh, just a satellite dish? There's two dishes, so I'm wondering if maybe they're... Would that be Archimedes 2 and 3 then? Is Archimedes 3 the one that's actually in the, uh, in the main Fallout New Vegas game? I always forget. Well, it doesn't seem so big. <laughs> I like how they have, like, Archimedes 2, like, on the side of it. All right, so I guess it's just Archimedes 2. Unless the other side says Archimedes 3? Question mark? Well, then where's Archimedes 1? Hmm.
finally out of that tin can. Think they bought it? Remain on your guard. The Enclave may be planning something. They wouldn't make it this easy for us. Man, I never imagined I'd be out here. This is this is crazy. Where is everybody? Over here. I think I found a way out. Oh shit! Things are about to get interesting. Everyone, activate your mag boots now. Well, we lost a couple of boys. What are we firing at? Oh, turrets? Okay. Come on. Oh, zero percent chance to hit, huh? Zero percent my ass. Wow, they really just spaced them? That's fucked up. Can I jump? I can, just a little bit. Well, we lost Tiger and someone else. I didn't see who else we lost. Courier, take point. We'll follow your lead. Got it, sir. What's that? A maintenance bot? That's fine. Up to and including. <laughs> Get fucked. Parks out of the way, please. I need to search the soldier to procure any equipment he might have. Okay. Open fire. Open fire on what? Bruh. What was that? Come on. Freak show. Oh, he's just unconscious. Thanks for the bits ragged. Just gonna take all that. Why not for now? Wait. Ow. Enemy contact. I can't search the LAP one. Guys, what are you doing? Hold on. So much for me taking point, huh, guys? I think we try to link up with the rest of our crew. Wouldn't just think. Well, if they're just gonna get knocked unconscious, I can kind of do whatever the hell I feel like then, huh? Uh, but our crew's over on that side. What's this? Let's see. Lock on notice. Activate docking port force field. Error? Okay. Well, never mind then. Hey! Your equipment's mine now, sir. A mini nuke, huh? And a nail gun. Ooh, son. Goddamn it, freak show. Scare the shit out of me. All right, boys. Let's continue sweeping the area. Well, it's going pretty good, Ragged. We uh, just got to the Enclave uh, space station. We're going to clear it out and see what we can find, I suppose. Is this locked? Inaccessible. Okay. We already lost two Watch people, so... You know who? I, I bet we lost Caboose. Anyone named Caboose is surely just going to die. Tramways, huh? Nothing in there. That's an eye, okay. Ow. I don't like that. Come over here, you little fucker. Uh, is that a sentry bot? It is. Oh, it can't hit me behind here. <laughs> oh, it moved. Fuck. I 
Out of the way, boys. All right, he's dead. Ow. Oh, Give me all of your stuff, that. please. Guys, stop dying. What are you even firing at? Uh. Well, boys, I'm sorry to say, but my gun's jammed. There we go. <laughs> oh. Station terminal. Let's see what we got here. Locked on notice, tram status, that doesn't matter. Boy, that guy does not want to uh, go down. It's my plasma caster now, motherfucker. Yeah, boy. Okay. I need to consolidate my gear here real quick because I'm over encumbered again. Let's see. Ooh, the Tesla armor, baby. Let's go ahead and repair that. Enclave Cosmic Tesla armor. Tesla helmet. Can I equip it? Boo! Give me fucking power armor training, sons of bitches. Let's see, engineer helmets. Are those worth anything? No. Let's see, we got the engineering suit. Ooh, it can be... I can use it for my, uh, my armor. Okay. Officer Enclave hat. I'm gonna drop those. Enclave officer uniform. Dropping that. My Enclave spacesuit is... dead. Cool. I don't think I need that anymore, though, so... I'll go ahead and put that stuff on. Let's see. That's 20. That's 3. The... That helmet's five, I'll take that. Those kind of suck. I think I'll repair one right now. Eh, no point right now. All right, weapons. A displacer glove, which sells for a pretty decent amount. That one's pretty good. The value of a multi-pass rifle is shit because it's broken. Plasma caster, compared to the weight, the value per weight is kind of shit on that one. I'm dropping that. Plasma defender, shitty value. Plasma pistols combined to be a shitty value. Okay. Excellent. Just dropping all this gear on the floor. All right, guys, let's sweep back real quick. That's a tram. There's another area back here I wanted to check out, boys. Let's check it out. I don't think you get a tank up here unless they have a tank on board. Is this just a, uh... Damn, just how big heads this place gotta be if they need a fucking train. Okay. We got a maintenance bot here who I'm going to take his shit. An enclave crate with some electronics in it. Those explode. I don't want to shoot those. Okay. Well, that was a dead end, pretty much. So I'm assuming we want to go on the tram, potentially? Maybe I need, like, a specific code or something to get on there first, though. We'll find out. What does this button do? Go to ground operations? Let's look at the tram first. Well, we can't do anything on the tram, so... I need you guys to uh, get out of the way, though. Looks like we're going to the ground operations.
Courier, disable that force field so we can regroup. Where's Caboose and Tiger? Vented out into space. Shit. Focus on the enemy. Welcome back, team. Oh, hello there. How's my current Longclave armor? Oh, yeah, it can definitely be repaired a little more. I'm gonna grab that. Thank you. Uh, fuck the laser pistol. Okay, let's repair that real quick. Also, you guys are just running all over the place. Like, the fuck? Test the helmet. Here we go. That's maxed out now. Wait, the spacesuit doesn't weigh anything? Are you kidding me? Wait. Why is that grayed out? That's weird. Although, given that it doesn't weigh anything, I might actually just wear that. Like, from like now on. It only seems like it'd be a... Uh... Easier. Okay. Area's clear. Good freak show. You know, guys, maybe we should like be bringing some of these power cores back. So they're getting uh, fucked up there, it seems. Like foot locker. I don't know why they're carrying bottle caps up here, but okay. Yeah, doesn't have any weight. It's grayed out, yet I can equip it. I don't know, it's uh it's odd. You guys okay? Siren, no, you're a medic. Don't go up front. What are you doing? Hold on, let me reload. Oh, those are turrets. Damn it, Siren. Fucking medic. Huh, oh, nice. Y'all good? Modified plasma rifle. Meh. Meh. What? It didn't blow up? Okay, they did now. Ow. Oh, hey, leveled up. Okay. Let's max out my science. There we go. Now I can just hack and uh, do whatever I want to anything else. Don't have to worry about power armor anymore. Another plasma caster. I bet it sucks. And it's broken as fuck. That's, uh, great. Alright, ladies and gents. Scour the area for any ammo or anything. Freak show, why are you on my ass, my man? Another plasma core. God damn. We could get, like, a bunch of these plasma cores and use them to, like, power the, uh, the airship that the NCR has. It would be brilliant. Okay. I don't think I searched this crate back here. Because everyone was kind of, like, rushing up and getting my way. Okay. And you? Nothing. Okay, guys, if you're gonna, like, just jack off in the corner, feel free to do so. I'm continuing on, though. What about this guy? Okay. Ooh, large crate, inaccessible. Why is this one inaccessible, but the rest are just like nothing? 
Huh? Siren, why are you unconscious again? Guys, it's one engineer. Kill it. <laughs> My god. Ooh, that's a lot of nails. That's a freak show. Pew, 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 pew. Just you wait till I reload, you son of the bitches. Oh, what? He must use a stim pack or something. Where you at? Oh, he flanked. <laughs> Just falling around. Shot him in the back of the head. I wish there was a button to just, like, take all ammo or something. Rather than... Why are all the multi-pass rifles, like, broken? I wonder what they're like when I fully rebuild them. I feel like I remember them being, like, decent back in the day. Also, there's just a bunch of weapons lying on the ground here. Bruh. Literally all of their multi-pass rifles are just destroyed. For some reason, I'm also getting a lot of spikes. Does one of my teammates have a spike gun and that's how I'm getting them? It must be. Another multi-pass. I'll take that. And I'm overweight. Alright, let's combine them. <laughs> Barely anything, but they do appear to be pretty strong so far. The damage will increase as I keep repairing them, but meh. Hello there, Colonel. Sit down. You got anything on you? Got a revolver. A couple of grenades. Officer Cap. All right. What do we got here? Argus. Archimedes Remote Guidance Utility System is the main operational core of the Archimedes 2 space station. The responsibility of Argus, yada, yada, yada. If anyone's ever in need of assistance, Argus will be here to provide any support that is needed. A distress call. This is a distress call from the Archimedes 2 space station to any and all enclave bastions left on Earth. Colonel Claude Marinilius, Archimedes 2, outer left wing commanding officer. My men and I are trapped on space station with no way out, and our life support is running short. We're in desperate need of rescue. If anyone receives this message, please respond. Their life support was draining. Enable tram access to inner left wing. Okay. Threat to us all. The last few weeks have been a complete nightmare. Argus has gone completely haywire and is a threat to us all. We've all grown used to having Argus consistently watch each of us in everything we do. Even if it was a bit unnerving having to take a piss with its eyes watching your back. Recently Argus has been acting up. Sometimes it shuts off power to an entire sector or seals off doors and thus traps people in parts of the station. It even once shut off the oxygen supply to my cabin, nearly suffocating me to death. At first, we thought Argus might just be malfunctioning, but then it started giving us demands and threatening to shut off life support if we didn't comply. It demanded we gather more specimens to expose to the FEV virus if we didn't. Also, FEV virus is a little bit redundant, isn't it? It's forced evolution virus virus, right? If we didn't have enough specimens in stock, it demanded we use our own soldiers as test subjects. We had no choice but to comply, or else it would kill us all. I watched my own men were transformed into those abominations. The lab coats seemed more than willing to carry out the experiments, almost as if they were all in on what was going on. Couldn't stand by and watch this atrocity go on any longer. Pool was left my men in the outer left wing, where Argus's reach was limited, and locked the place down so nothing could get in or out. But without a space shuttle, 
We are stranded here and our life support is running out. We can only hope the Enclave back on Earth receives our distress call and sends help. Otherwise, we won't last much longer. Well, rogue AI. Typical oh, sci-fi bullshit. Haha, -ha, another multi-pass. I rather dislike the trope that AI bad in like all sci-fi shit. Like, they could have just as easily, but, like, aliens started to invade. That would have been a lot better of a, uh, thing, I feel. Well, the past rifle is now doing pretty okay. A little more, and we'll have a bit stronger here. Wait. Freak show! Why are you always on my ass, bro? I gotta have a fucking toggle collision to get past him. Okay. Oh, crate up here. Didn't notice this one. Microfusion cells. Nice. So. I did that tram access thing. So is that. Oh. Hello there. Is that. Portland or is that. Um. New Vegas. I don't remember the maps very well. Nothing else in here. Okay. Looks like we're heading back the way we came. Oh, I missed this one too. Damn. I can't get through there. That large crate's for some reason inaccessible. Why are you guys just like standing around in random hey, positions? You have a job to do. I mean, do we? Can someone point me in the right direction? I already searched that one. Okay. I'm assuming we go backwards to uh maybe we go down again to the tram? Oh the door. Hello there. Yeah boy! Force it? No! Fuck. Well, that's what I get for trying to force a lock to save time. Damn it. Of course they have drugs up here. Alright. I already searched all that. So, yeah, we gotta go back down, it looks like. And then get into the tram. Also, did I search this ash pile? I did not. I was going to take. Well, no, I wasn't taking multi pass rifles before, so. Okay, 18 times 3, and now it's up to 20. Okay. Might try using that then for a little bit? It's not nearly as strong, but it might be funner to use. And the shotgun all the time, you know what I'm saying? Alright, so now we just go back to the tram. I think. And we maybe can ride it? Question mark? Engage tram. Can't be activated yet. Okay. Is there a reason why? Still can't believe we're, we're in space. What's my current objective? Talk to Officer Parker, damn it. This area is secure. Is there any intel you've gathered, Courier? Good work. We can use it to gain access to the rest of the station. Was there any more intel you've gathered? I've got a feeling something isn't right about this place. Space stations operate something called Argus. Argus? What is it? Some kind of AI supercomputer or something? You're, you're really close. Whatever it is, it seems to be in control of the space station, even the Enclave are threatened by it. Figures. The Enclave would allow their own technology to overtake them. So this AI, Argus, has gone rogue and the Enclave are just trying to find a way off the station. This is an unusual situation. I don't know if this can be a good thing for us. Or are we up against something far worse than the Enclave? Why are we here? Why don't we leave? 
we were here to like try to shut down the station, right? But I mean, if it's already gone rogue, then what is the point of being here, right? Am I right? Am I not right? I feel like I'm right. We're already come all this way. You're right. There's no turning back. We need to find this Argus and see what can be done about it. I would guess the core of the station is where we need to head. We'll use the tram. Let's move out. Like, if the Enclave doesn't come back to the station and, like, take over Argus themselves, they'll have to, like... Imagine what we could do with shit. all this right. technology. I don't know. The Might be just be me. Fried like Brominers, that's for damn sure. Our power like would be unmatchable. Where's the other group at, guys? I feel like we're missing a couple people. Like, a freak show's here. I love the ones keeping the other wing, like, locked down. Is that what's going on, guys? Hmm? Also, kind of suspect that the door didn't close. Why are we stopping? They cut the power. I guess we'll have to go on foot from here. Oh, here they are. No way, man. I'm not going out in that tunnel. What's the matter? You afraid of the dark? I have a bad feeling about this. It feels like a trap. Well, we can't stay here. I mean, you guys can. I'll go. Someone needs to go out to the tunnel and scout ahead. Courier, Roach, I think you two can handle it. The rest of us will cover you from the tram. Yes, sir. How? How will you cover this from the tram when you can't see forward? Also, watch them start the tram up again. And be like, okay, Courier's gonna die. Easy peasy. I would do that if I was Argus. The evil. Yep. The tram. Run! Get out of the tunnel! Wait. Of course Roach gets crushed like a roach, right? So let, let me see if I can actually do this without using the sprint mod. I'm gonna unequip my weapon. I think you're a little bit faster when you're not carrying a weapon. The trip. Run. run, Roach, run! run. See, Argus did exactly what I think he was gonna do. Roach, come on! I don't like that. No, don't you fucking save. I'm gonna try that again and see if Roach actually can get like in the area or if he's like stuck there. So it looks like you can um, make it by just walking normally. I'm gonna sprint though. And see if that helps uh, Roach get a little bit closer to me. Come on Roach, come on Roach. Okay, we should be safe here. What? How does he still die? Roach! No! I will lose your body, but... Rest in pieces. My friendo. You guys good? Eh. Eh. Okay, I can't jump up there again, huh? Yeah, it's a scripted death. That's lame. We made it. We survived. This is very awkward to uh, move around here. Am I supposed to be able to like, get up? I told you it was a trap. The station is trying to kill us all. We need to get out of here. Keep your composure, soldier. We still have a mission to see. Shame. We should have been able to live that. This terminal, we're in the inner left of the wing of the space station. Couple of stim packs, that's still apparently okay, it's on the left here, it looks like. Right there. A Gatling laser? Aw, oh, baby. Aw, oh, baby, if I had to wait for this. Is 
but I don't. Some sort of a biological research center. So what the hell went wrong? Yeah. Alright, I got lock and carry, guys. A lot of the data has been corrupted. I can't exactly tell you. Just tell us how to get to the core of the station from here. Unless we can open up... The tram access will have to go through the Biological Research Center. We'll need to investigate the area and find a way through. The longer we take, the more likely more of us will get killed. We split up into two groups. Tuner, Watchman, Rogue with me. Courier, take Badger, Freak Show, Mustang, and Siren. Head through the door on the left. We'll take the right. Rendezvous back here when a way through is found. And stay on your guard and watch each other's backs. We've lost too many already. Let me see if I can do anything on this. Data corrupted, emergency situation. Blah, 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 blah. We've got an emergency situation within the Biological Research Center. I need immediate evacuation. I don't know what the hell's going on, but we need to get out. Someone please open up the tram access so we can get out. We can't hold on much longer. Well, shit. All right, boys. Well, that's safe looking. Looks like a meat pile. That's great. Well, requires a key. Looks like we'll have to pass through decontamination first. Oh. Yeah. What the hell is this stuff? Put your helmets on! Mustang! Ba -ba -ba -ba. Space his helmet. What's happening to him? I guess the spacesuit as well. Okay. Wow, he's a ghoul. Mustang, are you alright? What's happening? Well, I don't know why they brought money with them up here, but uh, kind of a rookie mistake. Why did he attack us? It must have been the gas. It seems to be. I think I have a couple of these boys. Yeah. Go ahead and repair those. Hell yeah. He's searing and burning his flesh off, almost like he's turning into a ghoul. But what would do something? I like how the helmets keep phasing in and out. Better question is. Why are they pumping all that gas through the ventilation system? Something's very wrong with this place. I think we better find out what it is and put a stop to it. We able to move now? We are. <laughs> well, we lost four people so far, I think. Shame. Well, this is ominous. Very ominous. Pick cave fungus. Okay. Enclave boy over there, huh? Activate chamber control panel. More people in here? What if I do this? Uh, initiate gas? Is I gonna do anything to that thing? I mean, technically, it's already uh, been FEV'd, right? This gives me the creeps. Okay. Well, purge the chamber then. Let's go ahead and. Uh, should I open the chamber? Didn't I pump gas in there? I guess purging the chamber cleared the gas, right? Centaur blood. Don't need that for anything. Okay. They seem to be uh, non-combatants. What if I just open the door? Oh, of course. They uh, turn evil. Where'd the one with the armor go? Oh, he decided to actually attack us. Of course he did. Oh, 
Ultra Pass rifle kind of suck. I like how they took his weapon, but it didn't take his ammo. Good shit. Okay, well, I'll just uh, start killing him with extreme prejudice now. Let's go ahead and purge that chamber. There we go. Why'd the engineers come back? Fuck. What you got on you? Got any got any ammo? Nope. Open the door. Nothing on Super Mutant, of course, as one does. Don't get caught in the door, guys. What do we got in here? He looks kind of like a ghoul already, <laughs> doesn't he? Bottle caps. Hell yeah. Sounds like something's charging up. I don't like that. All right. What's on this? Agent Rust. Here, the Biological Research Center on Archimedes II Space Station. The Enclave has always been researching ways to increase the speed of erosion on synthetic material. We've developed a gas known as Agent Rust. Agent Rust is a highly concentrated sulfuric acid in the form of a gas. It has a pungent metallic smell and blood red cloud appearance, and its properties have proven to be highly corrosive to virtually any material it comes in contact with, making it extremely difficult to keep in containment. The gas causes such a high rate of erosion on materials that the uh, process of erosion can be seen right in front of one's own eyes. But the most significant properties of Agent Rust is the ability to neutralize radioactive materials. The applications of Agent Rust are limitless and can be used to turn entire bombed out cities into brand new fertile ground, cleansed of radiation in a matter of years. However, there are some troubling side effects of Agent Rust, the foremost being how it affects organic life. As expected, it can cause severe burns upon contact, but also has been caused uh, a rapid deterioration of the nervous system can essentially turn a subject into a violent husk. This has become an alarming issue as their hazmat suits have failed to protect against the gas. Gross properties, putting many of our workers in the clinic and out of commission. Astonishingly, the gas seems to have no noticeable effects on subjects that have been mutated by the FEV virus. More research would be done to find out why that is. And uh, research without restriction. Though some may have found Argus's sudden hostile takeover of the space station to be alarming, I have found it to be a great opportunity to carry out my experiments without restriction. It has certainly made my research a lot more exciting. I no longer need approval from any of my experience, allowing me to delve into research uh, most may view as immoral. However, Argus may need to be dealt with later in the future. Unfortunately for me, I have Argus shut down protocol codes if it comes down to it. He can be shut down by simply uploading the codes into his mainframe. Okay, and those codes are, sir, those codes are not in his office. Unless they're in a the locker. Nope, okay. That'd be too easy. All right, how about this door? I can open that door. But first... Hmm. Okay, what's through this door? Oh, it's just a bathroom? Okay, that's fine. Yep. And yep. And yep. Okay. I feel like the AI would not release something called Agent Rust into the, uh, the space station like this, though. Like, logically speaking, uh, why would you do that? Because if you did that, it's going to rust like all the way through um, the space station, right? And that would compromise the hull and thus compromise you as an AI, right? I got fucked, okay. Foot locker, nothing here. Activate the chemistry set. Create some drugs, iodine, mentats, and menthols. Create stem packs, hell yeah. A couple of metal boxes with a crutch and uh, cigarettes in it, of course. 
Old blueprints. Don't care. All right, boys, let's get moving. Middle locker, nothing. A wrench. Ooh. Well, this is a lovely scene. Oh, turrets. How nice of them to get back up after we walked past them. Yeah, this ain't fucked up at all. Hold up. Ah, compared to Windigos, they ain't shit, though. Okay, yeah, that, uh... The multi-pass rifle's not gonna do it for me. Let's get out of this hallway, boys. Form up a, uh, a line here, the doorway. And we'll just tear them down as they come. Boom, shakalaka. We good? Are we Gucci? Uh. Spacesuit looks a little worn, my sir. Also, I'm surprised our spacesuits didn't, uh, you know, melt from the uh, agent rust. Okay. Anything back here? Nope. Don't do this. Don't do this. Assholes, okay. Still inaccessible. Hmm. What are you looking at, you small skin? Relax. How do I get out of we'll this figure this out. outfit? Okay. Where am I going? Is there a way through one of these that they came through? I don't see anything back here or back there. This one's also just a dead end, I think. Oh, no, this one has a pathway, it looks like, and... It's a fucking dead end. Great. Oh, nope, there's a panel here. Nice. Fuck! Off with that shit! What's in the locker? Ooh, leather armor? Nice. Let's go, boys. Come on. Almost died, actually. It's a little bit sketch, but that's fine. Right, let's keep moving. Yeehaw. Gotta love the shotgun. Keeps getting better and better. What more agent rust? We're fine. I'm gonna conserve my uh, shotgun ammo for now, I think. Come over here, yeah. Wow, that was a miss. Way to shut this off, or they just keep spawning. Or... Experience is experience, I'll take it, you know, but like. Ow, my guts, no. 
Okay. What do I actually have for weapons again? I think that would help me out here better than the guns I currently am using. Wait, we're back here? Bruh. Purge that chamber. Purge that chamber. Purge that chamber. This place gives me the what do I have? We got the Abyssal Edge. That might actually... Actually, that might be good. Although, it does drain my health quite a bit. Uh, yeah, that's the only thing that would really do anything. So let's... Uh, just gonna put that away for right now. Okay. Well... Is this what I wanted? I'll make some stim packs while I'm here. Okay. Guys, would you be so kind to take on the fucking turrets for me? Okay. There we go. Oh, this is so much easier. This fucking sword is great. Oh, yeah, come on. Out DPS. Let's go, boys. Come on. Get wrecked, son. We good? We good? Okay. Let's go. Let's go! <laughs> I should just use the sword all the time. God damn. Getting a little overwhelmed here, but... It's okay. Y'all can't kill me. Yeah. You good. Action reminds me of home. Okay. Let's do a quick save so I don't have to do that all over again. Ah, hell. This just keeps getting better and better. No. I got these boys. You guys get the other doors. <laughs> Thank God we got this sword. Oh, you're gonna pay for that. Let me just get in this corner. Oh boy, here we go. Run, you little shits. Let's go. Come on. I'm just getting in a corner so you can't push me back, and then I can just flail. Come on, come on. Back, back, I say. <laughs> you want some two? Come on. All right. Take a little bit of a uh, rat away, methinks. Okay. All this action reminds me of home. Zombies are no match for my lightsaber. Well, that's a way out, it looks like. See anything else here, guys? Ooh, ammunition. Force it. Hell yeah. I don't mind forcing easy locks. The other one was just uh, nuclear waste back there, so we can ignore that. Let's do a quick save and continue back through here. Hmm. Animals, huh? Fuck. What the hell is that? Something big's coming. Mother of God. 
I'll tank it, guys. Come on. We got this. Okay, maybe I don't got this, guys. I'm sorry. Look at them just fucking using me as a shield. Little shits. If I go in here, can he get me? I'm pretty sure he can, but... Oh no. Well, I'm gonna get fucking guillotined in here. Hey guys, can you focus fire on this guy, please? Fuck. through so many stim packs there though. Um what if we take out his arms first? Let's go you little shits, come on. your arm doing? Not great. Okay. If I could, like, have his DPS, it'd be cool. I don't know if it's gonna work like I think it's gonna work, but we'll see. I really don't think this is gonna work. No, thank you. Ah, why'd I put the gun away? Fuck it. Headshot. Headshot. No! Damn it. The little fuckers. They got me. Started destroying me. Should have picked up the Gatling laser. Do I not have, like, any... Stronger? Hmm... What the hell is that? Something big's coming. <laughs> Ouch. Yeah, I'd do it for you, buddy. <laughs> I think it uh, spooked him at least, because he's not coming in here now. Almost killed me though. Come on, lure him in! Or just shoot him here, I don't give a fuck, either way. Hopefully, the husks don't step on those landmines. Come on, big guy, come get me. Those guys are gonna step on for sure. Yep. And ow, that tickled a bit. You guys good? <laughs> no, they're all down. Okay. The big baddie's dead. <laughs> you guys okay? Get fucked, you enforcer bitch. 
Please have a decent weapon on you, though, that I can actually use. That one could be fun. Mini nuke missiles, plasma mines, tire iron. <laughs> I guess that laser rifle one could be fine. Of course it. Nope. That's a shame. All right, let's see how this uh, fires against other people. Ooh, a stealth boy. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's a nice thing. Why would you put windows on a space station? That's just asking for trouble, you know? Oh. In the middle of an operation, I see. What were they doing to these people? Well, from the looks of things, they were uh, sawing their body up for parts, so that's something. I'm not even going to fucking open these. I already know what's going to happen if I do. Hey, this guy, uh, failed tip subject. That's a patient gown. Doesn't really look like a gown, but okay. Nope. Okay. Moving on. Is there another door over here? Was I seeing shit? Okay, I was seeing shit. That's fine. Well, this is all. Yep. Yep. This is a kill hallway, I said. As he looked down the hallway and saw this thing. And that's how we died. Well, this is, uh, this is definitely a thing. Key exit. There's not seem to be finding any stations. Okay. Well, I guess I'm gonna go this way then. Do I have anything on me or am I just fucking like... I've been gimped. Okay, that's great. This is great. So it says key and exit. So I'm assuming I need to go to the key first. Fuck, let's go! Oh, is this just a, a weird dream sequence? Where I can just punch these yahoos and they just go away? Metal briefcase. You got a key, Ruby V. I guess I just gotta follow the arrows back to the blue ones. Oh, what's this? Hmm. Ara ara. Are there some blue arrows? What up, psycho? What up, bitch? Ow. Wait, when they hit me, do they teleport me? Is that what's happening? No, no, no. You used to stay in there, sir. Blast door to question marks. Fuck. 
Okay. You insist? Someone took some inspiration from the Halo campaign. Oh. Sprint gave me a little bit too much there, I think. Jump up, please. I said jump up, please. There we go. Ah! Alright, easy. Still no, like, weapons or shit I can get in here, huh? What is this scenario that I'm in right now? Oh, little rockets. That's cute. I don't like the motion blur that's on my screen right now. What the fuck is this? What, you want to fight, mate? This is not okay. What is going on? Excuse me? I'm grabbing these weird spears and throwing them at these guys. <laughs> Am I supposed to like actually kill this guy? And this is fucked up. I don't have any skills in melee. Maybe this is one of those you're supposed to lose scenarios? If this is not a you're supposed to lose scenario, um, well, they just gave my health back, so I'm assuming it's uh, it doesn't matter if I win or lose scenario. Except for if that happens, then I die. So he can't kill me, but like other stuff can. Okay, I got gotcha. you. I'm not picking up what you're putting down. Okay, that hit him. That's bullshit. Ow. Yeah. We gotta like push him off the edge. Where did that go? There he is. I think I might just toggle God mode for this. This is kind of annoying. This is not fun. Like that, the first like little bit is cool. Like. If they maybe would have uh, given me, say, like, a gun or something to fight with, and not just a melee weapon when I don't have any skills in melee, 
But that's kind of fucked up, putting a non-melee character into a melee fight, right? Okay, how about this? Prick? Okay, too close. There we go. How about this? Prick! <laughs> Try escaping out of my vats, motherfucker. Off the ledge you go. You think you can win? That's right, you son of a bitch. Well. <laughs> I, uh, might need to move back up here. Actually got him off the ledge, which is cool. No. Ah. Is one of them just like jumping up around me and shit? Come on. Throw the damn spear. There we Bruh. There we go. I think one of them like got messed up because I was uh like standing down below when he spawned. Stop walking backwards. Let me actually get like There we go. That's not the way I wanted to go. But okay. Get in the ground. That's right. That's where you belong. Maybe I just keep collision on too. And then I just throw spears from up above. Don't have to worry about moving around on the stage. Fear me for I am your god now. You want some of this? You cannot escape my fury, Cyber Husk. Dude, my melee is so weak. Let's go, motherfucker. Come on. Come on. That's right. Down you go. Got a spear in my gut, but that's okay. You want some of this? Let's go. Alright, I'm gonna toggle con damn it. Toggle collision again here. I should need to go back into that stupid freaking spear throwing one again. Stop walking backwards. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yeah, that's what you get. That's what you get. Give me a shit. Didn't have anything good on him either. So we were just like, was this a weird dream sequence or something? Fuck just happened. Ah oh, man, that was one hell of a trip. I'm gonna re-equip my backpack real quick. There we go. Where are we? Look for a way out. Come on, door. Why won't you move? Oh, we're not getting through this door. Hey, check this out. This is the tool. Test subjects hazmat cowl, huh? Way near. I think I can hear someone on the other side. Another failed test subject. <sighs> Such a shame. That one really showed promise. Hold that thought, sir. Because if I have to re-equip all my goddamn weapons again... Hold on. All right, my spacesuit. Got my shotgun. Who the hell are you? What do you want with us? I guess I will have to try again. Fortunately, 
I now have more test subjects at my disposal. Lost. Come on, guys. Do something. If we don't do anything, we're going to be crushed to death. Well, do you guys have any questions? I don't think he plans to kill us just yet. Well, that's reassuring. I can't wait to see what his plans are for us then. Just look for a way to stop this. This is only just getting started. I feel like it's gonna close us in here and then it's gonna like drop us down or something. <clears throat> or not. <clears throat> if I just re-equipped all my shit for it to be taken away again, I'm literally gonna kill someone. Oh, look I'm at the I'm proven to be quite a resilient specimen. That is good. With you. I could do great things. I like the eyes on this one. Don't you fucking touch her! I like yours too. Not this one, it's too irradiated. As you were the one who failed my last test subject. You must now serve as a control for the next specimen. But who that next specimen will be, I leave up to you. In your opinion, which one of these two varieties would best support my research? I'll make matters simple. All you need to do is look to the one you would have me thyself. Go on. Make a choice for me. So we have either the doctor or Badger, who was just... Yeah, I'm going to look at Badger. Choose Badger? No. Hmm. Is this going to be one of those, like, hey... I'm actually not going to choose the one you're looking at. Yes. An excellent selection. Healthy. Strong. A fitting specimen. Don't let this bastard get away with this. You make sure he pays, Carrier. Don't worry, Badger. I figured we would need the medic later. Because the medic, perhaps, she can uh, put Badger back together? Maybe? Or at least save some people. Who knows? That's a lot of blood. You guys okay? Courier. Courier, are you awake? Listen. I managed to pick the lock on my restraints. Use this to get them off. You got them? Good. Now don't get up just yet. I have a plan. Might be a long shot, but we don't stand much of a chance otherwise. See that big tank over there by the windows? If we can find a way to make that tank detonate... It might blow a hole in the wall and vent out the mutants. You just need to look for something to shoot it with while we distract the guards. And be quick about it. It won't last very long against those things. All right, you ready for this? Okay, here we go. Fuck. Nothing there. Nothing there. Nothing there. Gun, 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 All this action reminds me of home. Bruh. How come I gotta shoot it with? That fucking dying here. Yeah, I can hear. Maintenance locker? Uh. Sierra Madre chips. Why are those here? Oh, you gotta pay for that. Um. Guys, I'm not finding anything to blow this up with. Oh, I got a shotgun! Ha! Maybe not. Uh. So, am I supposed to find, like, something like, actual, like, something here? Hold on. 
I'm just gonna talk with God mode because I'm not gonna I'm not gonna fuck with this. This weapon is a secondary Gauss attachment that can be fired pressing the number two hotkey, D-pad up on controller. Use the Gauss attachment to detonate the explosive tank. Oh, thank you, Isaac Clark. I understand that reference. Is there anything over here? Nope, okay. Let's see, the Typhoon prototype. I bet it has a fucking shitty scope on it too. Yes, it does. Get your mag boots on, boys. Hmm. Yeah, that's nauseating. Okay, this scene's kind of dumb. I'm going to be real honest. So I can jump really high. Actually, this gun might be really fucking cool. So we're just going to jump over to this. Any of my, uh, my friendos around here? I don't see any of them. I also only see one of the uh, enforcers. Ha! Imagine, like, actually having fucking gravity in space like this, though. Like, okay. Nope. Okay, I jumped. That's bullshit. Where did my team go, though? <laughs> what the fuck do you mean? It won't let me sprint. Like, holding shift... Oh my god, they disabled that mod apparently because pressing shift doesn't do jack shit now okay i'm just gonna fly over here like this this is kind of dumb i'm assuming it wanted me to land here somewhere are those two plasma casters on a uh thing let's see auto fire is off Fire cannons, left click, right click. Okay. Oh, this charts are pretty sturdy, okay. There's a gutsy over there. Hold on. I like these guns, but, uh... Okay. Okay, apparently that gun's just useless then, because it can't attack anything here. Oh no, it killed those things, it just couldn't kill the turrets and stuff? Weird. Am I still on, uh, god mode? Okay. I should turn that off. It served its purpose. Oh yeah, I'm over encumbered. Is that why I couldn't run? Bruh. Why am I over encumbered though? Is it because this is a 12 pound weapon that I'm carrying? I guess that makes sense. Fuck. 
It repairs your current equip up. God damn it, I failed to see that. Alright, what do I have? I don't want to pick up some cigarette cases here. Fucking fission battery is worth six pounds, my god. Get rid of. Each grenade is like 0.5, right? So that's two pounds right there? Yes, sir. Okay. Is that a fucking mini nuke launcher, bro? <laughs> Homie. What the fuck are you doing? Oh, that was a Tesla cannon. Oh, I'm sorry. Wait, can't I just fire? Hold on. Oh, yeah, it fires grenades. I forgot. Tesla cannon. Oh, it was broken. Never mind. Go on the ground. I should not have taken that cat eye. Do you guys have special ammunition or are you just like obscenely strong for some reason? Nope, just normal cosmic armor. I will take those harpoons though. Why am I over encumbered? What did I take? That actually weighs something? Drop one of those. Fuck it. Ah. I'm going inside. Screw this. I said I'm going inside. Screw this. Plus, of course, they just keep spawning. Yep, and they just keep spawning. Go, we'll get rid of that. I do kind of like this gun, though. Seems a tad weak, though. At least the main fire on it is. <laughs> okay. Yeah? Where am I going? Okay. Come on. Come back out the door, boys. What are you waiting for? Unless you're a coward. That's right. Everything seems to be moving in slow motion for some reason. Not because of the cat eye, is it? Nice thing to give me so much ammunition, though. Why is things going in slow motion? 
Like, is it some weird space effect that we're doing here? How quickly can I fire the uh, number two shot here? Pretty quick. Looks like it takes 10 shots, though. Okay. I think I just shot a guy off into space. Let's see, asteroid alert. The silo will remain locked until asteroid defenses are re-established. Recalibrate the asteroid defense turret by manually at targeting asteroids. At least two must be re-established. Oh. Okay, well, cat eye is away now, so that's good. So that's what the uh, large plasma cannons were. Okay. Oh, yeah, we leveled up. Okay. What are we getting up next? Uh... I'm gonna go ahead and get up my energy weapon, because this gun's pretty fucking pog, if I do say so myself. Also, let's see. I suppose I got a, uh... Any new perks for getting that? Tunnel Runner, the Warrens of the Divide have taught you to keep your head down. Your movement speed is greatly increased while sneaking in light armor. It doesn't matter. Nerves of Steel, you generate action points more quickly than you normally would. Lesson learned. I've always taught you some hard lessons. Uh, but you remember them all. You gain 1% to experience per level gained. Example, 25% experience level level 20. Eh, that's kind of cool, but meh. Spray and pray. Allow me to liberally spray the area with reckless abandon. Hmm. Doesn't matter. Do more damage for crippled limbs, atomic. You're stronger when radiated. Computer whiz, fail to hack, you can re hack stuff. Strength requirements are lower, tag, money is. Enter a conversation while iron sighting, that doesn't matter. Wait, purifiers melee on armed off. I was gonna take that for a second because I was like, I don't really want to kill this fucking ghouls, but never mind. Life giver, metabolism, night person, nerd rage, mysterious runner. Let's give him his fortune. Why not? Ow! Did I get fucking hit by an asteroid? Where do I calibrate these two? the question. Is that it? How do I how do I what do I, I calibrate it to? Am I like supposed to link them to something specific or Did that count? Did I just die because I got hit by a fucking... <sighs> yeah? Is that what we're gonna do here? I'm just gonna toggle god mode while I use this. Maybe I gotta like hit a certain amount for uh shit happens. I don't know. Okay, that's what I gotta do. Is 
This is like a mini game. It's so weird. Okay, auto fire is engaged. Nice. There's another one over here, I believe. Ow. Ow. I got him. God mode now. Use it. It's hard to uh, know exactly how much I have to do there. Okay. Recalibrated. Last doors. Everything's gonna fall. Right? No? Do I need to hit the lever and then? Okay. Imagine you do that and then it just like murders you because of the fell on you, right? Just imagine. Okay. Okay, God mode is back off. Nice of them to give me a bunch of uh, free stuff here. Don't want the fishing battery, but I do want those. Aka, you're up. Okay. Any more energy cells? I wish they wouldn't put shit in uh, lockers with ammunition, you know? Okay. Well, everyone, I do believe we will end things here. This gun is uh, actually kind of cool. I like it. Once uh, I get my like actual uh... look, wasn't that like it was it like ten or something before? And then I put a bunch of points into my uh, energy weapons, and now it's at like twenty-one. So this is going to be a cool gun to have, especially with the like just shotgun or like explosive round thing. If I get to keep it, it's going to be great. And uh, see how that goes. But anyway, we'll go ahead and end things here for now, everyone. And uh, next time, we'll pick back up with uh, destroying Argus and escaping the station, I'm going to guess. I bet my guess anyway. But uh, for now, we'll just wrap it up. So thank you all for watching, everyone. If you missed anything, as usual, VODs will be up on YouTube here in a couple of hours, so you can check them out. But for now, uh, we'll be ending stream. So I hope you all have a good rest of your week and weekend, and I will see you all next Wednesday in Deedly Doo. Uh, you all have a lovely time. Bye-bye. <laughs>